Hello, my name is Tom Kent, aka Tom Tricks, magician and balloon artist. And I have just done the world record for the world's biggest balloon costume. This costume here is made out of roughly 350 balloons and it took me around 10 hours to make. When I make these balloon sculptures like this one here, they usually stand up for a few days. I always draw out a blueprint of how I'm going to design the costume. I research lots of uh, pictures of the character so that I make sure I get all the little details in as well because um, when you're doing something like Pikachu, because Pokemon has a massive fan base, there will be people who will be able to point out if you've missed any little detail, if you've not done the red cheeks, or if you've you're not got the tail. So I always make sure they get all those little details in. The problem with making balloons is when you blow them up, they instantly start deflating very slowly. So over a course of time, you'll notice they start to shrink. Being inside uh, a costume like Pikachu can sometimes get a little bit claustrophobic. My vision is limited, so I always have someone helping me around just to guide me. If you've got small children just watching you and they'll just stand in front of you and just stare at you with awe, but because I can't see them, because they're quite low down, I'll just continue walking and I might accidentally trip up on the child. So it's always important that I have someone there just to be my eyes for me. I've thought about taking Pikachu out and scaring some Pokemon Go players. I've, I've taken costumes out before doing publicity stunts and just pretending to be like a statue. And then when people will come up and take pictures with with the costume I'll then move just to give them a little bit of a good old scare but it's all in good fun. It does sometimes feel hard getting rid of the costume after you've built it because you do feel a bit of an attachment to it. It's a piece of art that you've made but that's the unfortunate thing with, with balloons and after so long, as long as I've got pictures of the things that I've made in the past, I'm still happy.